You cannot sound out French words letter by letter. Some vowels have more than one pronunciation. Lou, bol. Vowels next to each other in a word are pronounced as a single sound. Beaucoup, sœur. But certain vowels next to each other in a word can be pronounced as two sounds in the same syllable if one of them is a semi-vowel. Minuit, bonsoir. The dots in the phonetic translation separates the oral syllables. And some consonants such as N and M can also affect the pronunciation of vowels. Bonjour, temps. In this lesson, I am going to explain how the six vowels are pronounced in the alphabet and inside French words using phonetics. I will also teach you all the letter combinations you need to know for each vowel and how to pronounce them. As usual, I base this video on my French accent. I'm from Paris. In the alphabet, A is pronounced A. Inside French words, the letter A alone without any other vowel is also pronounced A. It can be written with or without an accent. Cha, ra, à peu près, pat. En and am are pronounced en. En is a nasal vowel. Ange, jambe. Let's review the rules for nasal vowels. En and am are pronounced en if they are at the end of a word. Écran, bilan, if they are followed by a silent consonant. Gant, blanc, if they are followed by a pronounced consonant other than n or m. Ampoule, chambre. Otherwise, an and am are not nasal vowels. Année, banane, ami, flamme. Ai is pronounced e or e. The letter i can be written with or without a circumflex accent. Aimé, aide, traité. S'il te plaît. Now, let's talk about how to know when it's pronounced E, its closed pronunciation, and when it's pronounced E, its open pronunciation. AI is pronounced E if at the end of a word and followed by a silent consonant. Me, be. AI is pronounced E if followed by a pronounced consonant that is pronounced in the same syllable. Père, capitaine. AI is pronounced E if followed by a pronounced consonant and a pronounced vowel, meaning that the consonant is not pronounced in the same syllable as AI. Aider, baisser. AIL and AIL are pronounced AI, portail. Corail, volaille, ailleurs. AIL is only pronounced I if it is at the end of a word. Travail, L. AIN and AIM are pronounced un. Un is a nasal vowel. M. Fin. Remember the rules for nasal vowel. A-I-N and A-I-M are pronounced un if they are at the end of a word. Pain, chatin. Or if they are followed by a silent consonant. Sain, contraint. Or if they are followed by a pronounced consonant other than N or M. Craindre, vaincu. Otherwise, AIN and AIM 
are not nasal vowels. Fontaine. Aimé. A-U is pronounced O. Aube. Gauche. Sauce. Travaux. In the alphabet, E is pronounced E. Inside French words, the letter E alone without any other vowel can be pronounced E, E or E. Revenir. Effacer. Hiver. Now let's talk about how to know when it's pronounced E, E or E. E is pronounced E in one syllable word ending with E. Je, le, ce, de. E is pronounced E when it's not the first letter of the word. It is followed by a single pronounced consonant and a pronounced vowel. Recommencer. Demain. Mercredi. Calmement. E is pronounced E if followed by a silent consonant at the end of words, except T. Me. Né. Manger. Pied. E is pronounced E if followed by a double consonant and a pronounced vowel. Impeccable. Effort. Dessin. Cellule. E is pronounced E in words ending with ET. Poulet. Trajet. Chalet. Violet. E is pronounced E if followed by a pronounced consonant that is pronounced in the same syllable. Belle, hôtel, escale, baguette. E with an acute accent is pronounced E. Été, beauté, sécurité, journée. E with a grave accent is pronounced E. Frère, crème, maître, colère. E with a circumflex accent can be pronounced E or E. Fête, péché, crêpe, gênant. Now let's talk about how to know when it's pronounced E. Or e. It is pronounced E if followed by a silent consonant at the end of words. Arrêt, forêt. It is pronounced E if followed by a pronounced consonant in the same syllable. Tête, arrête. It is pronounced E if followed by a pronounced consonant and a pronounced vowel meaning that the consonant is not pronounced in the same syllable. Tétu, gêné. En and em are pronounced en or un. Both are nasal vowels. Lent, moyen. Now let's talk about how to know when it's pronounced en or un. En is only pronounced un when it is at the end of a word and not followed by a silent consonant. Parisien, européen. Otherwise, en is pronounced en. Argent, sentir, gencive, enfant. However, it is a little different for verb endings. 
In some verb endings, en is pronounced en, even if it is followed by a silent consonant. I go more in details with the rules for verbs in the last section of this video. Again, nasal vowel rules apply. En and em are nasal vowels if they are at the end of a word, ancien, or if they are followed by a silent consonant, temps, or by a pronounced consonant other than n or m, enlever. Otherwise, en and em are not nasal vowels. Menace. Parisienne. EAU is pronounced O. O. Oiseau. Ciseau. Verso. EI can be pronounced E. O E baleine venu Now let's talk about how to know when it's pronounced E or E. E I is pronounced E if followed by a pronounced consonant in the same syllable. Seize beige E I is pronounced E if followed by a pronounced consonant and a pronounced vowel. Neiger, enseigner. E I L and E I double L are pronounced A. Soleil, conseil. Abeille, bouteille. E I N is pronounced un. Saint, rein. Peindre, atteindre. As usual, rules for nasal vowels apply. EIN is pronounced un if it's at the end of a word followed by a silent consonant or by a pronounced consonant other than N or M. Otherwise, EIN is not a nasal vowel. Plein, pleine. EU is pronounced E or E. Bleu. Seul. Now, let's talk about how to know when it's pronounced E, it's closed pronunciation, or E, it's open pronunciation. EU is pronounced E if at the end of a word. Feu. EU is pronounced E if followed by a silent consonant at the end of a word. De. EU is pronounced E if followed by a Z sound. Z like the little b. Z. Serveuse. EU is pronounced E if followed by a T sound. Emute. EU is pronounced E if U has a circumflex accent. Jeune. EU is only pronounced E if followed by a pronounced consonant other than a Z or T son. Beur. Heureux. Jeune. Peureux. EUIL and EUIL are pronounced œil. Écureuil. Fauteuil, feuille, portefeuille. In the alphabet, I is pronounced E. Inside French words, the letter I alone, without any other vowel, is also pronounced E. It can be written with or without an accent. Ri, il, ma. Is. With AI, the diuresis on the letter I indicates that you must pronounce each vowel separately. Naïf. Aïr. I N and I M are pronounced un. Vin. 
important. Sapin. Infecté. As usual, rules for nasal vowels apply. I n and I am are only pronounced un if they are at the end of a word followed by a silent consonant or by a pronounced consonant other than another n or m. Otherwise, I n and I am are not nasal vowels. Fin. Fin. I double l is pronounced i. Fi. Grille. I double L is only pronounced E if preceded by a consonant and followed by a vowel, except in ville, nil, tranquille, l'île. If the vowel I is followed by at least another vowel, I is pronounced Y, like Y in the English word yes. Y is a semi-vowel. It cannot be pronounced alone. It needs to be pronounced with another vowel sound in the same syllable. Lias. Chien. Violon. Avion. In the alphabet, O is pronounced O. Inside French words, the letter O alone without any other vowel can be pronounced O or O. Lavabo. Chocolat. Now let's talk about how to know when it's pronounced O, it's closed pronunciation, or O, it's open pronunciation. O is pronounced O when at the end of a word. Video. O is pronounced O when followed by a silent consonant at the end of words. Do. O is pronounced O when followed by a Z sound. Chose. O is pronounced O when followed by a pronounced consonant other than a Z sound. Homme. Important. Rocher. Motif. Circumflex O is pronounced O. Bientôt. Côté. O N and O M are pronounced on. On is a nasal vowel. Donc. Complet. Leçon. Ombre. As usual, rules for nasal vowels apply. O N and O M are only pronounced on if they are at the end of a word followed by a silent consonant or by a pronounced consonant other than another N or M. Otherwise, O, N and O, M are not nasal vowels. Bon. Bonne. O, E, U is pronounced E or E. Oeuf. E. Now let's talk about how to know when it's pronounced E, it's closed pronunciation, or E. It's open pronunciation. It is pronounced E if at the end of a word. The. It is pronounced E if at the end of a word and followed by a silent consonant. Ne. It is pronounced E if followed by a pronounced consonant. Sœur. O I is pronounced Wa. Moi. Avoir. Soirée, voiture. With OI, the diuresis on the letter I indicates that you must pronounce each vowel separately. Egoist, héroïque. OIN is pronounced loin, loin, point, soin. Coincé. As usual, rules for nasal vowels apply. O-I-N is only pronounced one if it's at the end of a word followed by a silent consonant or by a pronounced consonant other than another N or M. Otherwise, O-I-N is not a nasal vowel. Moins. Moine. 
OU is pronounced O. U can be written with or without an accent. Lourd. Toujours. Cou. Ou. O U I double L is pronounced OUIE. Grenouille. Mouillé. Bouillon. Brouillé. If the digraph OU is followed by at least another vowel, OU is pronounced OU, like W in the English word weekend. OU is a semi vowel, it cannot be pronounced alone. It needs to be pronounced with another vowel sound in the same syllable. Oui. Pingouin. Tatouage. Jouet. In the alphabet, U is pronounced U. Inside French words, the letter U alone without any other vowel is also pronounced U. It can be written with or without a circumflex accent. Tu. Mur, salut, peinture, U, N, N, U, M are pronounced un, brun, humble. As usual, rules for nasal vowels apply. U, N and U, M are only pronounced un if they are at the end of a word followed by a silent consonant or by a pronounced consonant other than N or M. Otherwise, U, N and U, M are not nasal vowels. Un, une. If the vowel U is followed by any other vowel, U is pronounced U. It's like the way we pronounce the letter U in French. U is a semi-vowel. It cannot be pronounced alone. It needs to be pronounced with another vowel sound in the same syllable. Nuage. Muet. Sueur. Nuit. In the alphabet, Y is pronounced Y. Inside French words, Y can be pronounced I or Y. Signe. Y. Now let's talk about how to know when it's pronounced I or Y. Y is pronounced I when at the beginning of a word and followed by a consonant. Yves. Y is pronounced E when at the end of a word and preceded by a consonant. Rugby. Y is pronounced E when between consonants. Stylo. Y is pronounced E when at the beginning of a word and followed by a vowel. Yoga. Y is pronounced E when between vowels. Crayon. When you see the letter Y between vowels, think about the letter Y as two eyes, as it is also going to affect the pronunciation of the vowel that precedes. Voyager. Essayer. Appuyer. Payer. Of course, there are exceptions and other digraphs that I didn't talk about as they are quite rare. But all the letter combinations and pronunciation rules I just talked about will help you pronounce more than 90% of French words. And thanks guys for being here with me today. Don't forget to like this video and to subscribe to my channel. À la semaine prochaine!